What's up everybody, welcome back to the channel. So I'm doing another review for Bob and Brad, uh, the most famous physical therapist on the internet. I really love Bob and Brad. I've been watching their stuff for a long time. Uh, doing Jiu Jitsu, you're gonna get injured. So a lot of times, you know, like everybody else, the first thing that I do when I get injured, rather than go to the doctor, is look and see what it is online and how I can fix it. Uh, so I was stoked that they wanted to work with me and send me some of their products. So last time, we reviewed the C2D uh, massage gun, which I have right here. And I'm gonna use this as a comparison. So last time we used a Theragun and we kind of compared that the Theragun was a lot um, harder, right? So it feels a lot more like a drill and it's getting deeper compared to this. Actually, it feels like a massage compared to a Theragun that hurts. And the price point on this is very good. I think it's only like $110. So. Let's go ahead and open up the new one. This is the T2 massage gun from Bob and Brad. So first off, just like before, their packaging is, is really good. It's got the Bob and Brad right there, Bob and Brad on the side. The box just looks phenomenal right off the start when you get this thing. Very professional. You know, pull it out of the bag and it comes with its own little case with the Bob and Brad logo on there, which is also, again, very professional. So let's go ahead and open this thing up. And this is actually my first time opening uh, the box. So you can see everything is still wrapped up. I wanna do a comparison without even seeing this thing, without even using it. And then I just got done using this because I have an injury that I've been dealing with, which I'll do that. In a future video, I'll explain a little bit more what injury I have. So, this one is the C2D, and this one is the T2 massage gun. So right away, they're very similar in size, as you can tell. I'll bring them a little bit closer to the camera here. So, very similar in size, almost identical. Uh, this one has, I don't even know what that thing is on top. So they kind of got rid of that. I guess that's to stop it from overheating and they just made it into this. So a little bit more compact. The buttons are about the same. Looks like they got rid of the three lights there and they put them on top. So I would say that this one looks a lot more futuristic uh, than the old one. So it looks a lot more updated, like a newer version. Uh, just holding them both in my hand, I would say it's got about the same amount of grip on it. Uh, this one feels a little bit smoother, but besides that, it feels about the same. So let's go ahead and put an attachment on here so I can work on my hurt, hurt shoulder. Uh, the hardest part is picking which one we want to use here. So I'm going to go with this one right here for both of them. Let's go ahead and plug that in. So it's pretty easy when you're putting this thing together. Uh, you just push the thing in. If you want to take it out, just give it a hard pull and it's ready to go. So I'm going to start it out just I'm using it on my arm here. So we'll hold. So that's setting one, which is very soft. Let's get all the way up to the top. So it definitely has a ton of power on this top setting. Uh, it's still not as much power as, let's say, uh, the Theragun. So the Theragun, if I put this a Theragun right here on my wrist, it would feel like my wrist was breaking in half. Compared to this, it feels like it's just hitting the muscles. I never like to go to the full setting on these things, but it's pretty good. So now let's go ahead and put the attachment on the other one. To turn it off, you just hold the power button and you're back, back to normal. It has a charging port right at the bottom. And let's try this one out again. Setting one. And I'll turn this one on. So this one, uh, the newer one, definitely has a lot more power, uh, a lot more kick. So they must have heard me about the, the power on the last video because this one has some, a lot more kick to it than the other one. So they're both very solid guns. Uh, if you're looking for one that's not as extreme, like this one, just filling it in my hand, you can feel the vibrations are a lot more powerful than this one. So if you're looking for one, uh, I guess just a little bit lighter massage gun that doesn't hurt so bad, uh, this one, the older one, 
Again, this is the C2D, making sure I didn't get the name wrong there. The C2D is really good. It's a lot lighter, more just vibrates the muscles rather than getting in there deep. This one gets in there deep, but not as deep as a Theragun, again, to where it feels like bones are breaking. So this one will get deep, it'll penetrate the muscles, uh, and it has a ton of power. So I highly recommend, I don't even know, I can't give you a recommendation of which one I like more. I think they're both great and it just depends uh, Depends what kind of mood you're in, right? If you're really hurt and you're feeling like you need to get deep into your leg or something or maybe your hips cramping up, this one would be good. If I'm trying to get lactic acid out of my arms or I'm just trying to, to warm my muscles up a little bit, I think I would go with this one. So again, this one is the C2D. And the newer one that I'm reviewing today is the T2 Massage Gun. So go check it out, Bob and Brad. You can get it on Amazon. And hope you guys enjoy the video. As always, no liabilities.